Hello and welcome to Cornerstones of Math. Today we are going to integrate x plus 1 e to the x ln x from x equals 1 to x equals e. Alright, let's solve this problem. Because this integrand consists of multiple kinds of functions, we have to use the integration by parts where integral of uv prime is equal to uv minus integral of u prime v. So we have to designate u and v prime, but here we actually have three functions multiplied. The polynomial, exponential and logarithmic function. So how do we divide this into u and v prime? Well, I am going to let u as x plus 1 times ln x and v prime as simply e to the x. Then u prime is given as by the product rule 1 times ln x plus x plus 1 times 1 over x, which is ln x plus 1 plus 1 over x and v is simply the integral of e to the x, which is also e to the x. All right, so we have, first we need the uv part, so we have x plus 1 e to the x ln x, and we have 1 here and e here, minus integral from 1 to e, u prime v part, which is ln x plus 1 plus 1 over x, times e to the x dx. All right. Now let's calculate this part. When x equals e, it gives e plus 1 times e to the e. And when x equals 1, the expression is simply 0. So we have this. And for this part, let's separate the terms. So first we have integral of e to the x ln x dx. Then we have integral of e to the x dx. Then we have the integral of e to the x over x dx. Now for this part, we use the integration by parts again. Here we let u as ln x and v prime as e to the x. Then we have u prime as 1 over x and v as e to the x. Right, then we have uv is e to the x ln x and u prime v is e to the x over x. And now this term we can easily integrate which simply gives e to the x, then we have this remaining term. Now if we expand this part, we have e to the e plus 1 plus e to the e, and for this part, we simply have e to the e, then we have plus integral e to the x over x dx, and for this part, we have e to the e minus e, then we have minus integral e to the x over x dx. So here, this e to the e terms cancel out, and most importantly, this term and this term cancel out each other. So we have e to the power of e plus 1 minus e to the e plus e. And this is our answer. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in another video.